Hey babes, hello, hello, hello. So this is the actual very first spiritual reading that I did for DMX. Um, this was kind of like an accident. I wasn't per se trying to reach his spirit, but I was trying to see if we can guide him back to his body. But I did not know that they had pulled the plug. So by the time I finished this video, um, my hubby called and said <clears throat> he passed. I was like, okay, wow. So then I reviewed it, and then I was like, okay, wow. But anyways, I want to re-review it so that you guys know what, how, what, why, things like that, how I was taking it as I was hearing it, okay? But before we get into that, I want to show you two different things that has nothing to do with DMX, but it's a little concerning. So yeah, I want to show you this. <clears throat> Excuse me. Here we go. So that was one of them and this. So do you guys remember that whole Wayfair thing with the kids being um, sold and the cabinets? You know, things like that. They had the Wayfair. Then they started doing different car dealerships, okay? But now this is the newest one they found. These party hats, right? These Lumi Stick party hats. It's saying $7,937.76 for ages 3 and up. $15,000 for 5 and up. And one left down here for $3,968, and I, I'm not sure exactly how much that says on the bottom. Um, three months and up. Um, 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 hmm, okay. Uh, why is a plastic hat fifteen, almost $16,000? Five and up. Why do you have um basically a loomy stick party hat for a three month old? What kind of three month old is going to a party? It's not his birthday. He's three months old. Uh mm, I don't know, I don't like it. I don't like it, guys. I don't like it. So, anyways, that was one. But then two, I want you guys to see this. I want you to no, whether you pick the red pill or the green pill, it's still controlled by somebody higher. Check this out. I am not asking anybody to take a chance on me. I'm asking you to take a chance on your own aspirations. I'm not just asking you to take a chance on me. I'm also asking you to take a chance on your own aspirations. I haven't spent most of my life in politics, which most of you know, but I've spent enough time in Washington to know how much we need to change Washington. I haven't spent a lot of time learning the ways of Washington, but I've been there long enough to know that the ways of Washington must change. But her dismissive point, and I hear it a lot from her staff, is that uh, all I have to offer is words. Just words. Oh. We hold these truths to be self-evident. All you knew is just words. <laughs> Repeated over and over. Hmm. I am not asking anybody so, to take... I want you to see, like it says here, it's not plagiarism when you realize they're all puppets reading a script from one person. Okay, so, all right, but this has nothing here nor there of what we're talking about here. So, all right, let's do this. <laughs> it says, let's do this. <laughs> Let me grab my amethyst. All right. Hello. So, I don't have no water. I'm going to go back a little bit so I can read it. Now, I can't hear it. As my phone records, I can't hear it, so I have to read it. Um, it says, I don't have no water. Delete, bro. I see family. So I feel like he's saying he didn't have no water, I guess. You know, no water. Um, delete, bro. I could take it a few different ways, so I'm just going to pass over that. And I take it that he is aware that his family is around him, or he's able to see his family on the other side where he was at that moment in his time, you know. Hello. Vinay. 
Now, I noticed throughout the last few readings that I've done for him, he keeps calling me Miss. Um, so, was like, what, Miss? And then, mm, hello. So, they were just saying hi. Nika? Mm -hmm. Hey. Hello. Vinny? No. Remember who? Now, he no bar. It could be no, like as in, you know, knowledge, you know. Or it could be the word N-O. So, I thought he was saying he know. And then like a space. And then like bar. Just saying the word bar. But as I look at it now, it could be he has no, like N-O, bars. Because he's a rapper, right? I don't know. But then it says, yeah, yeah, I do. We met um, Jada. And you woke me up and was like, look who it is. You remember that? So I feel like my spirit guides are saying, yeah, they they were watching over what was happening. They they know what was happening. They see, you know. Well, I know another tough. Guy. Okay, that part. Uh, it it made me feel some type of way because at this point in time, I did not know he passed. Okay, so I'm trying to do something new in this video. I I'd, I didn't know if I was able to do it, but I didn't want to have no doubt in my mind that I could do it. So I went in believing I could do it so that I could get it done. Um, when he said tough, it threw me. And I was like, wait, wait, wait. No, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to hear him. I don't want to talk to him because I don't want to confuse him because I'm trying to get him back to his body. I wasn't ready for DMX to go. <laughs> I didn't feel personally that it was his time to go. So that's what I was trying to do. So when I heard that, I was like, oh man, my first, if you look in my eyes, the first thought in my head was, oh shit, that's his voice. You know what I'm saying? Like he's gone. But I'm thinking, well, maybe because he's in a coma that he just left his body and we trying to get him back there. So that's, um, that's that. He's having a hard See, time, that was it. right? I'm with him. He's fighting. So that could be meaning he's fighting because with Vinny or he was fighting for his life um, at that very moment. I have no idea, but it was pretty damn close from this reading and his passing. It was like literally minutes. Is Hold DMX on. in a coma, Vinny? I'm with him. He's, he's basically saying, no, he's not in a coma. I'm with him. And he's saying, yeah, he's my friend. You know, we, we together. Is his spirit in his body? Dead. dead. He literally just said, point out, he's dead. He's done. But I didn't hear that in red, real time. I might have because of the look on my face. But I didn't want to believe it at the time. It says, I trust them. Do it. I'm heaven. So I feel like he's saying he trusts his family to do the right thing, that he's in heaven. You know, he, he found his heaven. He found his peace. Has his spirit left his body? So here, like, I don't think I did hear the word dead. I don't think I heard it. I, I might have felt it spiritually, but I didn't hear it physically. Um... When they say he's off, I take that as possibly he's off of life support now. Um, he didn't have one. So I'm not sure what they're talking about. But then they say wake. Um, so I'm not sure what that means. Like maybe he didn't have something which made him not be able to awaken. I don't know. So, but that's, we could just skip over that. That might fall in together later on down the line. Um, but yeah, come on. Now this part is pretty cool. He says, "I am tough." Him say my name, and that's amazing. Just period in itself. I am tough. You're tough. You're home. Yeah, that's the part where I realize it's him, his voice, and I'm like, "Uh oh!" If you see my face, I get a little panicky because it's like. I'm trying to, I have the goal of him coming back. Watch my face. I am tough. You're tough. Oh, no. Okay. It dawned. Look, I don't want to confuse him. <laughs> I was like, wait. Ugh. I don't want to speak to him. I don't want to confuse him. Vinny, can you tell him to go back to his body? 
They're like, uh, he passed on, you know? Uh, how do we break it to her? <laughs> to lay down in his body and fight. He, he is tough, right? Fight. And this is what he's fighting for. Are you ready? Tell him to focus on hearing the machines from the doctor first. He can't check that out. He can't boop take. Like they took him off. You know what I'm saying? He can't do it. Every every time I tell them to tell him to do something that would bring him back, they're telling me he's gone. He's dead. He, he, we can't, you know? And then that whole boop, that's freaky. Once he hears the beeps and boops, and then I just happen to say beeps and boops. What? And then look, pull. He can't boop, take, pull. They're saying they took him off. And the focus on trying to feel the IVs in his arms and the neck. They said neck, dead, X right here, friend. That's crazy. So the neck part, I don't know if that means he had like a tr trouble breathing. I I'm not sure what the neck part means, but he, he, they're definitely letting me know he's, he, he was gone. Um, I just couldn't hear it in real time. I, I don't always catch everything in real time. Um, I don't catch 95% of it in real time. So then when it says X right here, friend, that, that, that just sends chills all down my spine. Hold on. Shut up, Bush. Sorry. And the machine, the ventilator. Okay. Once he feels that, tell him not to panic, but open his eyes and stay calm. Okay. Is there any way you can get his spirit that message? Nika, can you do it? Um, I love Nika. I love me some Nika. She's like, uh huh. Um, like Candace. Uh -huh. She sounded weary. But she was sound like she wanted to tell me, yeah, but she was like, uh huh. Like, uh, I don't know if I can do that. And then somebody else says she don't know. Tell him to fight. Visit Home Furniture for our spring clearance says, sales event. Oh, Find I'm doorbuster sorry. deals at any of our two locations. Then somebody else says she don't. Like, nah, she don't know. That's crazy. It's, oh, it blows my mind every single time. This is what I heard to wake me up. Girl. I said Earl, not girl. <laughs> Earl. Earl. Earl, wake up. Now, when I passed away, that's how I came back. Um, that's exactly what I heard uh, to wake me up, my name. Um, but nobody knew my name. <laughs> nobody knew my name. Period. Nobody knew my name. That was crazy. He hears. Like, like <clears throat> they're telling me he heard what you were saying. Then it says, that's what killed him. He had good money. What? So, I don't know if that's two separate sentences or if that's one sentence, meaning that's what killed him. He had good money. Or if it was more like, that's what killed him. And then dot, dot, dot. Oh, yeah. Also, he had good money. You know, I don't know. But that's not the first time. Well, this is the first time. But I did about four to five readings for him now. And most of them say the same thing about his money. I didn't even know he had good money like that. I thought that would have been like pretty much depleted, but not depleted. But yeah, I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> I don't know how to take that, so I'm going to move on. I think I felt something here. I think I realized something within my soul, not within my human physical form, but within my soul. I think I realized something here because it was just like an overwhelming feeling. It says, out in his brain, shh, please, she hit 
him the last visit. So out in his brain, I felt like brain dead. Okay, and then I felt like he was like, Shh, please, please, come on. It's too early. We'll stop with that. I don't want to talk about that right now, you know. But then this part <clears throat> has been throughout the readings broken down a little bit more. So she hit him the last visit. I asked if this a physical smack, like pow, pow, pow. Or was this like I hit him up with something? She hit him up with something. You know, something like that. They do break it down later on, but we're going to keep on moving. This was absolutely insane. I felt something totally. Thank you, Kanika. Thank you, Vinny. Kanika, can I talk to you? Oops. I know we should bind him. He's not good. Kick him out. So, or oh, Wait, what does that say? Out, yeah. So, I had a specific question in my head about a specific person who happens to be a male. And this is the response I got. So, they're talking about binding him, which would tell me he's not a good spirit. Entity, whatever you want to call it. Then they literally just say he's not good. And then they say, kick him out. So wherever he is, they don't want him there. They don't want him around. Literally, spirit, not physically. Uh, probably physically, too. But, yeah, let's keep going. She read my mind. Dean. Oh! As I say, she read my mind. She said, read. Like, I read it. Uh. I love you, Kanika. Thank you. Thank you. Um, Kanika's voice literally says, I love you. Met him. Oh, yeah. Bye, miss. So, I feel like Kanika's saying she met DMX. And he's like, oh, yeah, bye, miss. You know what I'm saying? That's so fucking cool. Oh, my God. Excuse my language. I'm sorry. Bye. I'm going to get going, okay? Don't know one, no, yet. Oh, don't know one, no, yet. So nobody really knew that he was gone yet, probably besides family. And then it says N-O. Thank you. <laughs> so, yeah, I guess <laughs> that's funny because then earlier I said this could be the word no, like knowledge or N-O. And look, it literally says that here. <laughs> Thank you. I'm the ex. I would like for you to just show me some signs of which path I should go down, okay? I I was talking to Kanika about that. I oh, how do I tell y'all this? I can't tell y'all this yet until I know exactly how to tell y'all um for safety reasons, but I figured out a lot of stuff with her case, okay? Um, I have not told anybody, including my hubby. I haven't told nobody yet. But I'm trying to figure out a way to tell it that will keep everybody safe, okay? I believe I cracked it. Um, so I'm not telling this to every babe on my channel. Whoever made it this far in the video will hear it. Um, but I was asking her, which way should I go with this? I'm, I'm a little lost on how to handle this and... I, um, I am afraid. I'm not going to lie. I am afraid. But I I just want to do it the right way. You know what I'm saying? So let's continue. Help. All right. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Vinny. It is done. And I'm going to believe that and I'm not going to have an inkling of doubt. It is done. Can you do the same thing for me? Not an inkling of doubt. It's done. Okay? Love you guys. Okay, so that is the very first one. I will do um, this next one, which would be DMX, EVP, IDC, crazy details. I'll break that down. 
the tarot card. It's basically broken down already. Um, and then I'll do this one here, EVP on... Com oh, no, not that one. <laughs> this one, DMX tells final moments. Pop Smoke also comes up in there, too. Oh, my goodness, I haven't heard from him in a long time, so that was amazing as well. So I got one... Two more to review, okay? And we'll go from there. I love you, babes. If you have questions, put them in the comments, too.